Howdy, howdy! Here we are in episode two of my Noise Modless Skyrim SE Let's Play series. I hope you're enjoying it so far. Um, eager to get right back into things. Got a few quests I want to start tackling, so we'll see if we can get some of that done, or at least start making progress. Um, I was actually going to wait until I got to a quest giver to start this episode, but I saw this gorgeous sunset. And I just had to show this off. We have what honestly looks like the Milky Way up here. This is a custom skybox of some sort. Um, and there's the sunset in the distance. So we got a, a little bit of ENB going on, um, as well as some, some reshade. I don't think we actually have reshade, but I definitely have, there's definitely some color alterations and weather as well. So look at that, isn't that gorgeous? And uh, getting pretty decent frames. If I open up my EMB overlay here, I'm getting about 51 frames, uh, which isn't too much lower than my 58 kind of locked FPS. Uh, if you play Skyrim, you pretty much have to lock it at around 58 to 60 FPS for stability reasons, because the physics engine is tied to the FPS. So just a little tidbit. Uh, anyways, I'm going to go and I'm going to find our next quest giver and I will be right back. Maybe you're looking to make some easy gold, yes? Yes, I'm listening. It's easy to find things to sell. Things nobody will miss. Things from underground or just left lying around in someone's house. Uh-huh. I bet the two of us, we're very alike. So why not take the next step? We can help each other. My sister DJ and I are treasure hunters. I'm like sure you're a treasure things. hunter. Hmm. I'm no of thief. Not. Thieves take what is precious. Thieves steal. We just take what will not be missed. What no one needs anymore. Maybe we take some weapons and stop a few deaths. Who would call that thievery? Hmm. Okay, what's your offer? Many more ships come through these docks, loaded with weapons and pay, but few people, and they pass through dangerous waters. I'm sure they do. We have an interest in one of those boats, the Ice Runner. Ah, the Salt Ice Runner. The lighthouse will be guiding it in, but if its fire were to go out, the Ice Runner would run aground. Okay. What an interesting idea. I think if someone were to do something like that, there would definitely be a certain amount of loot to be shared. Yes, if someone were to put out the lighthouse fire and then meet me on the docks afterwards, I could certainly direct them to that loot. All right. Uh... Don't worry about them. We'll make sure they wash up safe. Maybe they'll even pay us for the heroic rescue from their sad crash. All right. Let's do it. I knew so, uh, my character mind. is chaotic good. If chaotic good. However, let me see if I can, yep. Yeah. Uh, an important distinction to be made, I am looking for the pirates responsible for killing my father. And I have reason to suspect this Jari is involved or was involved. So let's let's see what we can do here. I'm gonna go along with this plan until I find whoever was involved. So let me get to the lighthouse and we'll be right back. All right, here we are at the lighthouse. Um, let me see, I don't think I need to go in. I think I can just go to the top. Yes, because this is the fire, right? And now it's out. Just like that. I wonder what's inside the lighthouse, or if there's any reason to go inside the lighthouse. I'm curious, because I don't remember ever being able to do this before. I trust you are not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? You approach as if you know us, stranger. Hmm. 
Interesting. So this is this dude's house. I'm just looking at the textures. Oh, they're gorgeous. Look at this place. Brilliant. And the lighting is mm, so good. Love it. But I'm not needed here. So let's carry on and find Jari. Um, ooh, is that Nernroot I see down there? Dainty slowed. I gotta go all the way back here. Now, hmm. let's see, it is Nernroot. Now, the Dainty Slowed is a pirate vessel, and I'm wondering if, oh, Horkers, stay away from Horkers. Horkers are bad, especially this early on in the game. So, Dainty Slowed has Corsairs, so... Hmm. Ooh, iron. Don't mind if I do. But do I have the mod that makes it so that... No! Oh, I don't have caco, it would seem. That's disappointing. Well, but, I mean, that wasn't so bad. Oh, there's gotta be some sort of mod. Because uh, normal vanilla Minecraft, or <laughs> Minecraft, <laughs> no, Skyrim, um, it's like three hits and you get an ingot, or uh, get an ore, and then it's another three hits and you get another ore, and then it's another three hits and you get another ore, and it takes like 10 to 15 seconds, maybe closer to 10 seconds, just to finish up with an ore vein. Very disappointing. All right, well, let me go ahead and just travel. And uh, I have a feeling that Jari is going to lead me to someone I need to stab with my stabby stabby. I must avenge the death of my father. All right, Jari. Looks like you had me. The effects have already been without the lighthouse. The my sister Tija will be at the wreck with <gasps> the Black Bud Marauders. They're the ones. I must destroy them. Uh, that's. Whoa, I gotta go all the way over there? Uh, don't want to. I, but, but, well, I mean, it's not gonna be too bad. I mean, again, no frostfall, right? Do I miss not having frostfall? Hmm, not really, honestly. Um. I mean, you know, it depends on what kind of playthrough you want to do. If you really want to do um, a playthrough with, like, you know, all your needs mods and you're going for super realism and, I mean, although, just listen to yourself talk. Super realism in a fantasy game? Like, seriously. Okay, the Nern route showing up like that is a little irritating, I'm not going to lie. Little annoying. Look at that aurora, though. It's a little muted. I'm used to brighter aurora when I play. Also, the way it's kind of clipping through the clouds is a little strange, I guess. Okay, am I getting close? Oh, here's some more Nern Nern root. So, Nern root pretty much only grows in specific spots. Uh, and there are quite a few of them, but um, probably one of the rarer um, herbs or whatever plants that you can find and pluck. Uh, also annoying. I mean, it's rare, but there's not a whole lot that uses nerd root. So and here I am. You can, look at all that. Look at all that nerd root. One there. There's one there. This gotta be it. Uh, can I hop all the way across? Doesn't look like it. Oh, it looks like we're considered to be in a river now because there's a current, which is interesting. The wreck of the Ice Runner has been discovered. 
Okay, let's see how I want to deal with this. Yeah, I think these are the guys I want to slaughter. You're the one who put out the fire in the light, right? That was good work. Deja's in the hold of the ship. Go down two levels. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. The Aurora just turned blue. <laughs> uh, am I gonna die? There's a distinct possibility that I'm going to die miserably. So let's go ahead and save here. Whoops. Uh, nope. Yes, we save. FYI, if you weren't aware, quick saving not the best idea. Wow, they're everywhere. Now I'm what level one with like zero eight, uh, you know, zero XP. How do I get down? Okay, that's unfortunate. Uh huh. Yeah, I I don't see this ending very well for me. <laughs> It's like little leaks sprung up in the ship. I do not see this ending well for me. Uh, what do I have in the way of magic? Conjure. I don't do conjuration, though. That's like one of my specific no-nos. No conjuration. Let's see. Yeah, so way wrists. Here's the... The, um... The lore, or the, well, it's lore and it's my backstory. King Bar Barinya of Wayrest in High Rock hired Corsairs. Um, they're the Corsairs that took over Wayrest. So I believe the Black Blood Marauders to be these Corsairs. So we're going to make it happen. I'm just double checking. That doesn't actually say that I avoid conjuration. I believe that to be a different um a different uh background for a different character. So I don't really have anything magic wise to help me, so I'm gonna die. <laughs> Here we go. My brother told me you were coming. Ha! I'm afraid the loot's all yes. been Yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No! Don't die. Don't die. Is there anything in here that will help me? Uh, let's see. 30, yeah, so. Ooh, minor health? I don't mind taking a ring of minor health. Note from Jarees and Septums. Uh. Ooh. Five gold per hour versus health by 20 points. Uh, I need that mod that lets me have two rings. <laughs> I'll take the minor health for now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like that. I like that. I like that a lot. Octics. Um, so I'm kind of in deep shit here, but let's... Search chest is empty. Chest is empty. Ooh, potion of my magicka. Uh, I don't think there's any way for me to walk out of here without dying miserably. Uh, don't quick save. It's bugged. I think I said that before. It's like built into the... Oh boy. Yeah. Oh. 
Yes! Ho! 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 Do I save again? Yes, I do. Smilodon is definitely... <sighs> yeah. Uh, damage 11 versus... Damage 11. And I'll take it with the heck. I think I, I, think I can... Uh, this is all stuff I can put in the museum, right? Collect everything. Well, there's a lot of stuff here I can't collect, unfortunately. So I'll go ahead and take the Imperial stuff. Steel dagger. Uh, yeah, okay. I should probably... Oh, look at all the books. Collect all the books. Books are good. We collect books. Unfortunately, it's a little irritating to click through all of them. Let me get through this and be right back. Okay, we're just uh, kind of sneaking through the ship now. My sneak's not very high, but um, at the very least, I can level it up a little bit, right? Oh, let me save really quick again. Oh. Too shabby. Oh boy. I don't see this ending well. Don't see me. Anybody there? No, nobody's here. Go away. I'm not here. I was sure I mm, yeah. Level up that sneak skill. Sneak is like my number one skill, too. So that's good. Was close. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, Nord mead. Take that. Maybe I can craft something with it. Some septums. And then let me. Okay. Yeah. Oh, steel war axe. I guess I'll take the steel war axe. Okay. Good. Good. Let's continue. Is there someone watching? No. Okay. Yes, good. Continuing. I want to walk because there's no sneak penalty. Ooh, I wonder how close I can get to this guy. Probably not very close. I'm going to guess I can't get very close at this low. Yeah, no. Yep. Hey, yep. Yeah, it's... Uh, it's tough. That's part of a mod, by the way. The effects. Lightning effects. Uh, it's really tough to go against a sword player, swords, and person with just uh, robes. <laughs> One of the reasons I generally don't like playing a pure mage in Skyrim. I, I've only ever played a pure mage in Skyrim once. Uh, and the early part of the game, you're so weak. It's not very much fun. But then towards the end of the game, you become kind of ridiculously overpowered. So, Okay, mm. how many are there? Just one, really? Kidding. Gotta be more than just one. Just one. Okay, I, when I'm not inside of a dungeon i like to go into third person view just because let me just really quick do i have studded armor pure light armor i don't have studded armor uh steel dagger imperial sword yes imperial bow yes oh don't mind if i do <clears throat> Let's do, uh, oh, maybe maybe I'm thinking of the wrong ship. I, I thought there was a Stone of Baron Zaya in this ship, but kind of looking like there isn't. Yeah, you're not a very good shot, are you? 
Take that. All right. Um, that was that was that. The, the Black Blood Marauders finally got revenge. Although Jari is apparently the uh, instigator, so I need to go back and deal with him. Oh, I need to find out where they took the loot. Yes, of course. Well, I think I already know. It's this place up here somewhere. Uh, oh, there's a note. That's right. Note from Jari. Broken Ore Grotto. Yep. Oh, man. Broken Ore Grotto. It's so far away. I guess it's not too far. Uh, let me travel there, and we'll be right back. All right, we're approaching the camp here, Broken Ore Grotto. Uh, looks like there's some spookies outside the camp. Let's see if I can snag these guys. Oh, there's no one here. There's a fire. <laughs> Convenient. I'd care more about that fire if uh, I was running Frostfall. Spiky grass. Here we go. I'm having a tough time deciding if this stuff on the beach is sand or snow or ash from uh, the Red Mountain. Hmm. Okay. So I'm actually going to turn off my light. I am going to draw my sword. I don't think I have a better weapon. The axe, but I don't know the sword. I don't anticipate this ending well for me. Yeah, okay. Well, that was kind of ridiculously easy. kind of don't want to go oh he's got a bow oh crap oh yeah that's right I'm gonna need potions or uh, get that resur um, resurrection a resurrection Restoration, yeah. All right. Ooh, cheese galore. You know, now that I think about it, food, even if you don't ha have a needs mod where you gotta like cook food and eat food and all that jazz, um, it's still a decent source of, oh boy. It's still a decent source of health. Um, yeah, look at that. Look at that. Perfect. Now let's just come down here nice and quiet like. Oh, he saw me. Yeah, that's right. Take that. This is not a small cave. I'm trying to remember. Uh, it's been a really long time since I've done this quest. I generally avoid this quest. Not a huge fan of this quest. But I seem to recall. Never should have come here. Oh boy. Oh, and I got a level up. Let's go ahead and level me up. Sneak, light armor, and restoration. Oh, and my, my DVC, 
on on attributes. Uh, let's see if I can find that. One, two, one. So one magicka to every two health. So I'm gonna go ahead and do. And then I'll make a note here. Health, Magicka, and Stamina. So, should be two, one, one, three, one, three. Very good. Gotta keep track of this, right? Um, now, what am I gonna put this into? Well, um, I noticed that smithing is not on the list here, but sneak is the first one. 10% harder to attack while sneaking. Ow, 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 ow. Ah, that's right. Okay. Steel mace, banded iron shield. Um,. And now this looks like stuff that I can, you know, sound fire if I so desire. I don't really desire, but good to know. The option's there. Minor healing potion. Never hurts. Alright, I think I go up this way. Man, it is hard to see in, in here. Now a mixture of the E and B and just the various graphics mods I have. Okay getting close now we go ahead and save here let's see if I can finish this quest before I run out of time here oh oh yeah there's a lever lever clunk oh boy I don't think there's a way for me to really sneak it oh boy yeah no there we go. Oh shit. Um I need more food. Damn. Run. This is very unfortunate. Let me see if I can get back up and around. Uh, it doesn't really look like, I mean, I guess I can go up here. Kind of going back to where I started, almost. Uh, come on now. Oh, here we go. L, so I can see what I'm doing. Is that a chest? Ooh, a chest. We like chess. Yes, we do. Okay. Oh, a lot of red wine. Alright, time to go back. This time I'll skirt around this side. Kind of skip the. Oh. Whoopers. Okay. Do I bother sneaking? I guess. All about building up those points, right? Ooh, iron ore. I gotta skip the iron ore. <laughs> Don't need iron ore right now. I do need to kill some of these baddies. Probably my next uh, point will go into um, into light armor. Yeah, yeah. That's how it works. Please tell me I'm. Leveling up my sneak capability. Oh yeah, that's how it works, huh? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Cool, here we go. Yeah, I know. Oh. 
Run. No. <laughs> Light armor upgraded. That's right. Ow. Stay away. Okay, I don't think any of them have bows. Ooh, yes. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm not yielding. Come and come at me, bro. Oh, he. <laughs> really? He's just gonna come at me with his fists? Man, so much of this game is like gaming the system. <laughs> uh, I am curious what's out here. It doesn't look like there's really anything. Oh, but I can come over here to the ship. Here we go. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, no, no! Okay, where was my save? I think my save was just before running back. Let me see if I can take care of these guys, and I'll be right back. Okay, I've basically uh, finished off these guys. Um, Jari and what's-his-face, they're still down here, like, I don't know, they're, like, underneath this thing somehow. They glitched under there. Uh, I may have to... Now, oh, where are they? Where'd they go? I legit do not see them. Where are you? Did they go all the way up somehow or something? I'm confused. Oh, they're up there? What? That can't be right. go no Jari's still in an east somewhere okay card wills good yeah sure why not journal hargars I'm not gonna read that right now well actually maybe I will read it let's see what it says where is it Hargar, Hargar. There we go. Okay, so it's just Jari's been doing this to a lot of people for a long time, basically. That's what it boils down to. Ooh, a boiled cream treat. Any books that I need? No. Uh, yes, real Baron Zaya, definitely. Good. Oh, followers of the Great Fox. Don't mind if I do. And the Red Apple. So, I think it... I need to defeat Jari. So, let me come back down here. Uh... The hell is Jari? Aha! Ooh, Captain Hargar. I was gonna cheese him because he's got like this. You can see his level there in red. He's got this insane amount of HP and armor. Really, I think it's just HP. And die! Okay, where's Jari? I do not know. Oh, come now. Oh, Jari's over there somewhere, I guess. Ugh. I need a bow. Okay, I'm not gonna really... This is just... Hey, come on, you. No arrows equipped? Oh, I have to have arrows. I, I don't have any arrows? You're kidding me. No arrows? What the hell? I'm 
shouldn't need very many. This I do the trick. Yeah, there we go. Where are you going, Captain Hargar? Give me that. Alright, now let's go back up. Yes, items. Where's my sword? Steel sword. There we go. Let's go find Jari. I don't know how Jari ended up way over here. He like glitched out under the water or something. Where's this Jari? There's Jari. You're gonna die, buddy. Oh, you're going down. You're going down, dude. You're going down. Whoa. <laughs> he went flying. Completed lights out. Nice. Look at all this good stuff. Okay. Uh, from a roleplay perspective, there's nothing else in this cave that um, I'm interested in. But I do want to wipe out the rest of the marauders. Like, I want to, I really want to wipe them off the face of the planet. So I'm going to do that, and we'll be right back. All right. Everyone in the cave. Um, and yeah, the quest is complete. Lights out is complete. So that's kind of our first, uh, you know, regular quest done. Very pleased with the results. We got our inventory basically full here. A uh, nice load of stuff that I'm going to um, try to sort out. And then whatever I can't sort, um, I'll just either disenchant it or sell it, depending on, you know, what's available. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what we're going to do next time. I'm thinking, uh, looking at my set of quests that we're supposed to do here. Uh, rise in the East and Break of Dawn, maybe next. So, we'll have to see. Um, after I get some of these kind of story-based quests out of the way... Um, We'll start kind of really role playing. Uh, in the meantime, we've explored kind of the darker side of um, Elaine's psyche, shall we say? Um, she just avenged her father's death, so she's feeling happy, but maybe a little sad. Well, they weren't vampires, and she's a vampire hunter, so. Anyhow, again, hope you enjoyed. Uh, feel free to like and subscribe. If you have any comments, suggestions, feedback, questions, let me know in the comments section below. Check out my Twitch channel at Mystic Daedra and Twitter as well for more information and more gameplay. Once again, hope you guys enjoyed. Take it easy.